and join us for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge, pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. What's up, Auburn Mountain View? It's Chantel. And I'm Nolan. And we're your hosts for Jen. Her. Oh. And for me. Shun. To start off with, the AMHS cheer team is having a restaurant takeover at the Habit Grill from 4 to 9 p.m. on Friday. Are you gonna go, Nolan? Oh, absolutely, Chantel. Oh yeah, we'll see a lot of friendly faces there. All you have to do is bring a flyer or have a flyer on your phone and just show it to them. Mm-hmm, hope you all attend. Next, homecoming week. Next week, we've got Spirit Week. On Monday, Stars and Stripes. Tuesday is Beachers versus Greasers. Wednesday, Camouflage Day. Thursday is Senior Citizens. And, and Friday, Friday is Color Wars. Wars. Next, we've got Movie Night on October 2nd on the field at 6.30. It's free to everyone, but there's also concessions selling hot dogs, pretzels, popcorn, what? candy, what? soda, anything that you desire. The football game is home tonight with a beach theme, so come to the Luau. And next week, the homecoming football game, it's a whiteout. Be there for the tailgate for the color mayhem. And, and that's, that's on, on what? what? Period. <laughs> now for Carson with Career Center News. Thanks, Nolan and Chantel. Now for some Career Center News. I'm your host, Carson Clementson. And I'm your co-host, Addison Jones. Hey juniors, kickstart your STEM career with the Western Aerospace Scholars. It is a two-part program focused on the history and future exploration of space by NASA and topics in Earth and space science. If interested, the online application is October 30th. They also have a program for sophomores which will open in December 2019. Stop by the Career Center for more information. Next, we have the following universities coming to the Career Center next week. Pacific Lutheran University and Eastern Washington University will be here Tuesday next week. Also, Linfield College and Abilene Christian University will be here next week on October 2nd. <laughs> Lastly, St. Martin's University will be here October 4th. Sign up in the Career Center. And thank you. Next up is Sports with Eric and Tone. Good morning. This is AM News. Live from Tone and Eric. This week we'll be talking about sports, sports, sports. For Monday, we have boys tennis and boys water polo. Tuesday, we got golf, tennis, volleyball, girls soccer, and girls swim. Wednesday, more water polo. Thursday, same as Tuesday. And Friday, we got our home game, homecoming football game against Kenwood High School. Let's go! <laughs> How about the boys tennis team? Man, I've, I've been hearing about this boy. His name is Grant Harris. I heard he's been lighting it up out there. He's just been playing phenomenal. I phenomenal. Mean. Win after win. Man. Putting our school on the map. Soccer team, they've been playing well too. Huh? Yeah, you got yeah. Andrea Guyton. Wow. Multiple touchdowns in multiple games. She's been putting on a show. Yes, of course. She had a recent hat trick. And I'm pretty sure she scored almost a goal in every game, Eric. I agree. She has been lighting it up on the field. How about this boys golf team, Eric? I heard about this guy named Cole Reynolds. Cole Reynolds, more like Tiger Woods. This kid just, he's the future Tiger. Future, future Tiger? Future Tiger. Future Green Jacket? I'm talking, yes, he, masters after masters after masters. Well then, Eric, we are in for a treat. How about that number five on the football team? You mean Cinnamon the Tiger Tegan Child? Yes. That man has been spectacular on the field for the football team. He is putting up yardage after yardage. He's been giving it his all. 100%. I think we're in for a treat this season, Eric. How about the girls' swim team with the first dual meet W? How just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming. And boys' water polo. Unfortunately, we lost two close ones. 
but they're still in it. Keep your heads up. Just keep swimming. Just, just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And for the girls' volleyball team, Eric, how about Azaria Johnson? She's been killing it. She's been on top of her game. Yeah. Insane skills. And here's Mac Chandler. For your weather next week. Thanks, Eric and Tone. I'm your weatherman, Mac Chandler. And next week's forecast, as you can see, is 100% Lion Pride for homecoming. No, I'm just kidding. But actually, next week's forecast is 100% sunny. And be out there for Wednesday's movie night and Friday's football game and then Saturday homecoming.